So let's talk a little bit about starfish. You might have gotten an email or maybe you heard a staff or faculty member mention starfish and you're curious as to what it is and how it can help. So starfish is Gateway's communication tool. This is the communication between staff, faculty and students. And we also use it for scheduling. So if there's an individual department that mentions Starfish for their appointments, make sure you check out their web page on Gateway's website um, for more information about how to schedule an appointment. And then really, it's a way to get help. So it's a way for you to connect with staff and faculty um, and really some of the resources around campus for someone to reach out to you and let you know how you might be able to receive that. So there are three specific types of communications that Starfish deals with. So the first one that we're gonna talk about is a kudo. Just like it sounds, it's a good job or a pat on the back. So here's an example of an email that you might get from Starfish and what it looks like. So you'll notice at the top, all of your emails from Starfish are gonna come from notices at starfishsolutions.com. And in, in the subject, it will let you know exactly what that email entails. So this one says, you've done a great job, keep up the good work. And then you can see who it's from and some of the comments that they put in there. So that's a kudo. A flag on the other hand is something that maybe things aren't going so well. So it's a communication from a staff or faculty member to let you know that you have something that you might need to pay attention to or something that needs to happen. So here's an example of one and what that might look like. So this flag you can see at the top says log into Blackboard to stay on top of your assignments. So it can tell you exactly why they're raising that flag and why this communication is being sent to you. And then they're gonna write comments that is gonna be a communication directly for you. So this one says, you missed three classes this month. If you have any questions, let your instructor know. So those are kudos and flags. And then the last thing that we have are referrals. So this isn't telling you good or bad progress necessarily, but this is connecting you to those resources we mentioned. So this might be, a staff member, maybe you've mentioned it to them that you would like help in a specific area, or you can do this as well and actually raise your hand and say that you need help with a specific resource. So maybe you're looking for tutoring or maybe disability services, or you wanna to talk to financial aid. Any of the areas that we have resources for, you can raise your hand and someone will reach out to you. So here's an example of what a referral might look like. And this one is for the success coaching program. Again, this is the email that you might get and what it might look like. And it's gonna tell you exactly why it's being raised and it's gonna tell you some more information. So if you'd like to reach out, there's some specific information along with the link to the website. Again, just like a flag and a kudo, you're going to see the comments to the person who raised the flag or if you put any information in when you raised your hand. So we've been talking about raise your hands. So let's look at how that actually works and how you might get to Starfish. Hopefully you're familiar with my path. If not, this is our homepage and all you have to do is go to gateway.kctcs.edu. This brings you to our live homepage. And we're just gonna hit this first link, my path. And that will bring you to pretty much every resource that you're going to need in your time at Gateway. So make sure you keep this bookmarked. So we're gonna go to my path and then you're gonna find the little tile that looks like a starfish. You might have a couple less than this and that's okay, just depending um, on all the things you're involved in at Gateway. So go ahead and find that tile that says Starfish and click on that and it's going to bring you right to your home page in Starfish. Now again, just like my path, yours is going to look a little bit different than mine, depending on your connections and what your role is. So this is what your home page of Starfish is going to look like. You're going to have your connections here and your services. So if you're looking for anything specific and then up here to the top left is your menu. And that is how you're gonna to get to anything that you might need. So click on that top little three line menu in the top left corner. You'll see raise your hand at the bottom, messages, which is where you can see that flag that I was raised. And then you can also see any upcoming appointments and also change your profile if that's something you're interested in doing. Thing to know about Starfish is to raise your hand. When you need help, make sure you get that early. Don't wait until the end of the semester to seek out the resources you need and check your email. You saw some of the emails that you might be getting depending on how your courses are going. So check your email, reach out, ask questions, and raise your hand if you need help.